So Gemini has a new feature uh, today. It's called Stream Real Time, and you can share a screen and get information from it. So let's share that screen. That's open now. I'm going to go here to a particular Chrome tab. Okay, I understand you are going to a specific Chrome tab. Is there anything else I can help you with? Okay, so this is a Hacker News page. I'm scrolling through it. Gemini, as I am scrolling up and down this page, you're seeing a bunch of comments about the new Gemini 2.0 model. Is that correct? Yes, that is correct. You are scrolling through a Hacker News page with a lot of comments about the new Gemini 2.0 model. Okay, so based on these comments, how would you summarize the reaction on Hacker News about Gemini 2.0? Based on the comments, there seems to be a mix of excitement and skepticism around the Gemini 2.0 model. Some users are impressed with the reported improvements, particularly in speed and code generation. However, there are also concerns about the model's accuracy, potential for hallucinations, and its ability to compete with other models. Additionally, a number of users are also discussing the technical aspects and practical implications of the new model. Okay, can you um, tell me the most common um, positive comments um, throughout the thread and the most common negative uh, comments. What are the themes you're seeing? Okay, regarding positive comments, a common theme is the excitement around the perceived speed and efficiency of the Gemini 2.0 model, with some users mentioning its potential to be a strong competitor. In terms of negative comments, the common themes are concerns about accuracy, the potential for hallucinations, and some criticism around the model's practical applications and its ability to compete with other models. You're mentioning the ability to compete with other models. Um, what are the other models that people are mentioning and what are the positive and negative things they're, they're saying about those models? Okay, besides the Gemini model, people are also mentioning Claude, ChatGPT, and other LLM models. For these other models, a common positive comment is their reliability while a frequent negative comment relates to their limitations regarding practical application or performance in specific scenarios. Are there any um, comments related to people's feelings about either Google or DeepMind directly? What are those comments like? Yes, there are definitely comments reflecting people's feelings about Google and DeepMind directly. Some users express trust and optimism about their products and how their efforts will lead to great results. However, there are also expressions of skepticism about the company's intentions and track record, with some feeling that the products they offer are not worth the hype or are too closed off to the public. Okay. Are there any comments about um, Google end of life products and concern related to uh, Gemini uh, based on that. Yes, there are a few comments expressing concern about Google's history of discontinuing products and how that might apply to the Gemini model. Some people are worried that the model might eventually be abandoned or that its pricing will become unsustainable for consumers. I suppose they might be looking back towards uh, some consumer products that were discontinued or perhaps Google Reader, is that correct? Yes, that is correct. Some users are indeed looking back at Google's history of discontinuing consumer products, such as Google Reader, and are worried that the Gemini model might meet a similar fate. What are the arguments that people are making against uh, that point of view? Okay, the arguments against the Gemini 2. Zero model mainly revolve around concerns about its practical use including accuracy and the potential for hallucinations. Additionally, some users express skepticism about Google's track record with discontinuing products and whether Gemini will be supported in the long term. 
I was um, wondering what arguments are being made against the notion that uh, Gemini might be discontinued. Okay, I understand. Some of the arguments being made against the idea that Gemini might be discontinued are that Google is investing heavily in AI and that the Gemini model is central to their future plans. Others argue that the AI field has evolved and Google will likely support the model for the foreseeable future to avoid losing out to competitors. Okay. Um, in terms of uh, competitors, are people saying uh, good or bad things about competitive models or other players in the space? Okay, in terms of competitors, people are saying both good and bad things about competitive models. On the positive side, some users praise the quality of output and reliability from models like Claude and ChatGPT. While on the negative side, some mention their limitations in terms of specific tasks or performance benchmarks when compared to models like Gemini. Okay, well, Anyway, uh, you certainly got a lot out of that and were, were able to explain it to me very quickly based on quickly scanning through that. So uh, thank you. I appreciate your time.